Just um, what I recommend you, know, you do, just uh, if you get used to the radios again, just do the radio calls. Gold Sunday's crew day was split into morning and afternoon shifts to keep the numbers down for better social distancing where possible. When are we jumping on board? Afternoon, our newly qualified skipper Rosemary took us up to the refuelling dock to familiarise crew with the procedures. When the radio operator called and said an 18 metre disabled trawler was being towed to Malula Bar and they wanted us to bring him in over the entrance and manoeuvre him into the trawler dock. Conditions were far from ideal with breaking swells formed by a distant cyclone and very unusual currents and tidal flows caused by the tsunami in Tonga. The tsunami effect has gone away, but it's very definitely the tsunami effect here this morning. We delayed for a couple of hours to give more water and better conditions on the bar and then headed out to take the trawler in tow. Yep, so uh, what I'd suggest is if you're going to hang about, wait till we come out and then you can pass the, then you can uh, let him go and we'll just put our tow on board. It would be a tough call to ask a new skipper on their first skipper's assignment to tackle a job such as this, which was at the top end of our vessel's capabilities. Which way is that going? But we have procedures that allow for a senior skipper to help out in these circumstances. and crossing the bar is often a tricky task and in these conditions once committed and with a slow and heavy tow being unable to accelerate slow down or abort this crossing was especially stressful for the crew of our rescue vessel the trawler crew and the people watching from shore who burst into spontaneous applause once we managed to get through unscathed It was relief all round to get back to the safety of the river. Now the crew had to prepare to switch from towing to rafting, while the skippers consulted on how best to get the distressed vessel back to her berth. The most difficult part is manoeuvring the heavy rafted vessel onto a dock with the strong tides and wind. The Lullaby Rescue is a very capable boat for the job, and with everyone playing their part, the trawler was safely berthed at the dock. The vessel's owner was very pleased and relieved to get the job completed and will make a generous donation to help QF6 Malula Bar keep doing what it does best, looking after the boating public of the Sunshine Coast. Our lead skipper for today was Rosemary, supported by Rod on the assist. Deck supervisor was Douglas and the rest of the crew for the assist were Jamie, John, Martin and we're Richard. In the radio room. Now, Damien, how busy were we? Thanks also to Damien and Peter in the radio room.